Uh, my name's June Thoburn. I'm an emeritus professor of social work at the University of East Anglia. I'm also a Lancastrian. I was uh, brought up in Leyland, went to Balshaw's Grammar School, and I'm delighted to have an honorary degree from UCLan. So it's great to be back here. What do you think of the use of book groups in social work education? I, I think they're just such an important part, I would say indeed an essential part of uh, social work education, whether it's, I love the format you got here, but I, I was one of Olive Stevenson's students in 1963, and the first thing we did on our course was um, read novels and discuss them, so um, I, I think book novels, fiction, drama, films uh, are very helpful in, in two ways. First of all in encouraging empathy and empathy is absolutely central to social work, relationship based social work that is. Uh, but also um, understanding theories, uh, making you stretch your, your thinking about the possible causes but also the possible solutions. What drew you to this project? Um, well, I didn't know anything about the project <laughs> until I gave the Olive Stevenson Memorial Lecture and I uh, was talking about the importance of uh, Olive's way of teaching, which was the use of, of novels to, to help uh, we uh, well, youngish uh, people who, who clearly limited in your own experience. So through a, through a novel or through... Uh, uh, in, in this case a biography, you can uh, learn to put yourselves in other people's shoes. So at that point, Amanda heard about my uh, talking about book clubs not being new, or at least using novels in teaching, not in social work not being new, and said, would I like to come up here? So I was absolutely delighted. What do you think social work students get from attending a book group such as this one? I think uh, they get, first of all, the experience of reading the book. They're, they're, they're so busy, they've got so much to read, and um, A, it's, it's good to read novels. Novel, that's, uh, in, in many ways, it's, it's light relief, but it's also, uh, uh, as I say, a very good way of learning. So uh, what they actually then get is discussion with their own tutors, they get discussions with people like me who come in from outside who have a particular interest so they uh, meet up with ideas which are not necessarily being um, given to those of the people their immediate tutors so and i think they enjoy the exchange between uh, professors um, managers whoever is introducing the book thoughts do you have about tonight's event? I was deeply touched and moved by the way the students responded to um, uh, what to me was a very important book, a very personal book because I, I knew the, uh, the, the person who was writing the biography but the sensitivity of, of their questions, their responses uh, did move me actually and the, the, the the validation, if you like, of, of Olive's um, sense of what social work was about because I, I didn't see a difference between the essence of what these people were talking about in their practice and what Olive was talking about over the years. Okay. What is it about fictional books that can create such a lively debate in a room full of budding social workers? I, I said at the at the end of, of the, the session that um, fiction allows you to cry, um, that uh, there's something about, in, 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 if the books are carefully chosen, they address the themes that the, the social workers and the students are dealing with, the pain they're dealing with, uh, when, okay, sometimes they go home and cry, but more often they just try to forget about it but you go to you read the book and you can really get into the the feelings of sadness um, and uh, I, I think that's very powerful well it's cathartic 
Would you recommend Book Club to other